Hello everyone, hope you're having a good day and welcome to the Tundra Dude 34 YouTube channel. Well, today's the day. My cover is finally here. We're going to install Tano Pro, $300 from Realtruck.com. I believe it was about $318 after the taxes and everything, but it was free shipping uh, for Black Friday slash Cyber Monday. And I'm not a huge fan of Tano covers, but I had to get one because I bought a 2023 double cab Tundra and they have shrunk the double cab quite a bit. And it was getting to the point where the back seat was becoming fairly unusable. It is very, very tight back here. So when my wife and I travel, which we do pretty often to Pennsylvania, uh, this would fill up very quickly. So when we would throw stuff in the bed, we always had the threat of rain. And the last trip we took, it did rain pretty good. And a lot of stuff got drenched. So now had to do it. Uh, soft trifold cover. Good to go. I mean, there's some great hard tops out there. But I got the soft trifold because um, it's not going to be on the truck all the time. It's pretty much just going to be when we travel. Uh, but I use my bed for a good amount of stuff, so I didn't want to have it on there permanently. So we will open up the box. I'll show you what it's all about and how easy it is to install. When you order the Tonno Pro, it asks you if you have the deck rail system or not. As you will see, they send uh, a couple brackets that go in there so you can put the top on. But very simple, quick install. And once again... If you're in the market for a Toyota Tundra in the new generation, make sure before you pull the trigger on the truck, determine what cab will work best for you. Crew Max, if you have any rear seat passengers totally, if you're someone who rarely uses their back seat, I mean, this is a good way to save a few thousand dollars. I mean, this thing is fully loaded TRD off-road. You could get it with a lot less features in it, but it all comes down to this. So make sure you go and physically go in the truck and see if this works for you. This will work for a lot of people. But like I said, when my wife and I go to travel, this fills up very quickly. So I will say this, a recommendation if you do get a double cab, you're going to need a tonneau cover. So here's the tonneau cover. It was delayed in shipping for a few days. It was supposed to come Saturday, then Sunday, then Monday. Finally got here Tuesday. The box, I haven't opened it at all. The box is in pretty rough condition on pretty much all corners. There's a hole up there. So hopefully this doesn't turn into... This was supposed to be the tonneau cover install video to show you what it's all about, but really it's broken and I got to send it back. So let's hope everything goes well, but the box is in pretty rough shape. All right, everything looks to be in order. No issues. It has the instructions. It has everything wrapped up pretty good, as you can see. Some brackets for it. Pretty simple looking cover. Tri-fold. There's the box falling over because it's windy and freezing out here. All right, it shouldn't take very long to put this thing together. Okay, first thing we did was we unpackaged it and we laid it up at the top just to make sure she fits before we strap anything down. You're seeing this for the first time with me. Nice tri-fold. I always get scared when I order anything for the double cab because everybody has the crew max and I'm always terrified that I'm gonna get the crew max option. So I always put in the notes, yes, it is a double cab. But if it's good, it will lay flat. Will it be waterproof? Probably not completely. Probably get a little leakage over on the corners here. But no big deal. It's just for our travels. All right, let me officially install this. I love how flat it is. It's good material. I had one of these on my 2016, and it did the job just fine. So once again, great option, a little bit cheaper than some of the other options out there. Here's a finished product on one side in the front of the truck. We got the bracket. The cover is tightened down to the bracket that you have to put in the deck rail system. And the tether is installed over there. Here's the rear part of the tonneau cover. Again, bracket in the deck rail system. No big deal. You just got to take out that little clip there. But in the rear, you just lift that up. It comes off the bracket and then you lift the top to tighten it. Just throw it down like that and she stays secure. Tonneau cover installed. Not a problem. Deck rail system, no deck rail system. If you need the instructions, they're very simple. But uh, if you do have the deck rail system, it will come with some extra brackets, as we saw when we were outside. And then you will have the brackets for the clips on the upper part of the tonneau cover toward the cab. And then you have the adjustable handles at the back so you can tighten the rear of the cover. One thing to notice when you put these covers on, this isn't the only brand I've used. It always seems like in the beginning because the cover's brand new and it's been folded up. It looks like the back sits up a little bit. 
and over time it kind of settles to the bed more. So keep that in mind. If you put it on and it looks like the back of the trifold against the tailgate is sitting up a little bit and maybe not flush all the way down against the tailgate, a couple days in the sun, a little use, it should settle quite a bit. Those clips in the back, you can actually adjust to tighten the rear of the bed cover down. If you don't like the way it goes on, you could always, uh, you know, move around the bed cover and find exactly what you want. 300 bucks. It's something I'm not going to use all the time, but for a double cab owner in the new gen with the limited back seat, I feel like this is a must have. And I didn't want to get a hard cover like I told you guys in the beginning of the video because I don't want to have it on there all the time because I use my bed for stuff that the tonneau cover won't be able to be on there for. I like the fact that it's trifold, so I could fold it all the way up and clip it and get it out of the way if I don't need all the bed. If you're in the market for a tonneau cover, just go check out uh, you know all the major websites. I got mine from realtruck.com and you will see all of the different crazy options they have out there. But super simple install. Glad I did it. Glad I have it for the traveling. You have a double cab or are about to buy a double cab, new generation Tundra. Tonneau cover is a must. Go check it out. Let me know down in the comments below. Do you like tonneau covers? And if so, are you a fan of the soft cover like I have or the hard top Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook, TikTok, at Tundra Dude 34? 100 dude 34 gmail.com. You guys have a great day. Be safe and be well. Thank you for watching.